Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Today we are playing a game that just came out and this is Witchy Life Story. Um, I saw the trailer for this game over on the recent release games on Switch and thought it looked really really cute. Um, I know with the story you need to make brew potions to help people but that's about all I know but I thought the design, the art style and design of this looked so so cute um, and I thought I need to play that. So. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we're doing. Um, I'm all cosy. I, I got a little bit um, wet coming home from work today, so I'm all wrapped up in my cosy blanket. <laughs> right. Okay, let's choose the body. Oh, and um, as pale as possible, please. Right. So that's one, that's two, three. Four, five, and one. Right. Um, I guess we will go with body three. Um, oh, freckles, cute. Oh, oh, here we go. Face. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, what's this for, I wonder? Oh, oh hair colour. Okay. Uh, about a little bit that way. That one. Right, short straight, ponytail, long size shave, afro, cornrows, crew cut, floofy, that's cute, floofy, short side shave, hijab couple of hijabs. I hope I'm saying that right. I have short curly. Do we have short curly? Let's see. Pigtails, they're cute. Pixie puffs. <laughs> Romantic. Oh, I like that one. Ah, uh, it's not quite... Mm, it's not quite the length of my hair so shall we go with the long curly i think we'll go long curly right and i need more bluey eyes so i do have blueish eyes what eyes to choose from sort of looking at myself here <laughs> Trying to get as close as possible. Oh, maybe them. See, my eyes are something I always have quite a um. I don't want to say issue with. I'm just always a bit. Uh, I'm not very comfortable about my eye shape. I have very sunken eyes, and I, I, you know, not very comfortable about it really. But. Oh, that nose, I think. Oh, that one's cute. I like all the designs. Oh, I quite like the smiley mouth. Oh, I quite like that one. I think I'll go with that mouth. Sort of a little bit of a smile. Um, so I don't... Yeah, I don't want freckles. A couple of different blush to choose from. Oh, number three. Uh, I do get very red. I think I'll go with number three. Oh, and you can have lips or no lips. That's interesting. <gasps> you can have glitter. Well, I want the glitter. <laughs> um, fashion. Oh, okay. Cute. Oh, that's pretty. Mm, oh no. Oh, I like that outfit. Cute. Oh, these outfits are so cute. Mm. Oh, I might go with a cape. <laughs> I love that one. Oh, well, guys, made this come, made these outfits. Can can you come style me, <laughs> please? <laughs> so cute um, I think maybe the cape outfit I think that one let's have another look yeah I think the 
cape. And then I really like this one. Excuse me, hiccups. I think I'll go with the cape. Bow. Ooh, maybe the celestial. Oh, the flower crown. Daisy chain. Oh, they're all so good. And the flowers. Oh, look at the tiny hat. I want a tiny hat. <laughs> a pointy hat. Hmm. Oh. Oh, I like that hat. Oh, I quite like that hat. Oh, the celestial hats. Oh, oh, there's too many hats to choose from. Oh my god, how am I going to choose a hat? I don't know. Um, mm, crooked one's cute. I love the I think I might go for the celestial one. Oh, glasses! Yay! I can have glasses as well. Yay. That makes me happy. Oh, I love those tiny ones. How cute are they? Ah, cute. Right. Mmm. I think I might go for the cat eye ones, actually. And I need some earrings. Because I do. Can't really see, but I do, I do have earrings. Two pairs of earrings in. I had done many years ago. <laughs> um, I think we'll go for the celestial ones. And right. So there's mine. And how do I change my name? There we go. Right. Uh, capital and. Luna. Luna. There we go. And then space. And other capital. Nope. Hang on. I'll get there. I'll get there. There we go. Then no wolf. Yay. Oh, I think we look amazing. <laughs> She's a very stunning. I'm going to screen. No, I can't take a screenshot. Oh, that's no fair. Oh, how cute. Oh, all just says when the sun icon appears in the bottom right corner. Right, I'll keep an eye out for that. That's good to know. Oh, look at the background. It's so cute. <laughs> Sorry, I'm very animated with my hands. So if you ever see like a glimpse, of it's just me moving my hands because <laughs> I just like wave them around <laughs> all the time. <laughs> I'm very animated, <laughs> which isn't always a good thing, but <laughs> I have smacked myself in the face a couple of times with my hands. <laughs> oh, the joys. I'm very clumsy. <laughs> I hope everyone is having a lovely day. It is very wet and windy here. Oh, here we go. Oh, we have a really long name. My name is Luna Wolf Von Teasel. Diesel, I hope. I am 18 years old and I have a crow familiar named Ramsey. That's so cute. I dislike listening to my gran and people and drama. Well, apart from the gran bit, that sounds like me. <laughs> I like my familiar Ramsey and witchcraft and being me. Everyone in my family thinks I'm hopeless, which is why they sent me here to the village of Flora prove I'm worthy of having the Von Teasel family name, or whatever. Honestly, I wasn't listening all that much when my grand told me. <laughs> well, I think this is it. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, the village is pretty small. Do people actually live here? <laughs> we need to go to the town hall, right? Grand said something about that. Whatever, it was there. Well, I guess it was Gran's choice to send me here. The rest of my family just wanted to disown me. I'm sure that's not the case. Either way, I'm here, aren't I? Isn't that enough? Look at her facial expression. <laughs> She's so mad. <laughs> when they could have just... Oh. Um. Let me do my own thing. But no. So I acted out a little. They deserved it. 
don't tell me you didn't think it was a little funny. I needed to get my frustrations out somehow. No, Luna Wolf, that's not how you hold an atom. Luna Wolf, why don't you wear the traditional Von Teasel garb? A Von Teasel shouldn't speak like that. Are you sure she is really a Von Teasel? Maybe someone switch switched her at the... Yeah, I know it's better not to give them any mind, and they're not here to say things, but they're still going to judge me at the end of it all. Sure, let's head to Town Hall. The mayor's supposed to be expecting us or whatever, right? <laughs> yeah. I think this is it. No, you knock. <laughs> you don't have hands. Use your beak. Hello, I am Ruth, the Mayor of Flora. Can I help you? The Mayor? I'm Luna Wolf von Teasel. Luna Wolf? Yes. Von Teasel? Yes. Is Margie with you? Margie? Marjoram von Teasel. Oh, my gran. Nope. I see. Will Marjoram be joining you later? No. I see. Gran, um, Marjoram said you'd be expecting us. Well, we were expecting a Von Teasel, but truth be told, we were expecting... <laughs> the letter? Oh, that's right. My Gran said to give this to you. You take a letter out of your pocket and hand it to Ruth. Ruth opens it and starts to read. You notice her face growing more and more. I see. I asked Margie if she could help us with our harvest festival during a critical time. And Margie sends me her grandchild, who needs to prove she is worthy of training. Ugh. Ruth, was it? Are you okay? I'm sorry. Pardon me. <laughs> I lost focus there for a little. Are you sure? I just should have expected something like this. This is all. So, you're in trouble? Just a little. But you do know what you're doing. Yes. Um, for the most part. It's more of whether I want to do what I know I should be doing. Then tell me, Luna Wolf, was it? Why do you need to prove yourself worthy of training? Shouldn't you be finishing your training at your age? I guess. <sighs> I think it's time for my morning nap. I see. The mayor skims over the letter. Mm. This letter also mentions something about a magazine. Magazine? My grand mentioned a magazine. Why did Gran have to mention the magazine? Covenpolitan. That sounds familiar now that I think about it. That's right. It's a witchcraft tips magazine, correct? We have a villager who's an ardent reader. Do you now? Just your luck. It was all a big joke, really. No harm was really intended. But I guess the... Um... <laughs> weed cleansing, jade eggs or mushroom tea. I'm going to go with weed cleansing. Pushed it a little too far. But I wrote all the spells under an alias. Avon Elset. So it's not like readers know it was a Von Teasel witch. My grand shouldn't have been snooping through my grimoire in the first place. Or rather, Avon Elset's grimoire. Okay, even though the whole thing was made up. Of course, of course. So we shouldn't expect any of them the same shenan shenanigans. Sorry. No. And did your grandmother explain what she'd be doing here in Flora? Helping out with a festival or something yet? I kind of only half listened. We're hosting our annual fe harvest festival, the Floralia Festival in two weeks. Flori... Flor... Flora... Leah, that's sorry. As you know, harvest festivals are held to bless our villagers, villages and lands with prosperity and abundance. However, for the past well, for the past more than several years, I'm afraid, our harvest festival has been lacking, and thus, thus flora has grown smaller and smaller. And this year is looking to follow the same pattern. It's why I reached out to Marjoram. I feel like all our energies are just off somehow. I was hoping she'd help us with our festival. You got me instead. Perhaps this task means Marjoram trusts you. It seems odd she'd send her grandchild to complete such a task if she didn't. 
one I actually wanted to distance me and the family. Sometimes space is just the thing we need. Either way, I suppose we'll just have to make do. How about I show you around and introduce you to some of the villagers? Right. He agrees. You, Ruth and Ramsay make your way down the hall. Ruth knocks on an office door. Cute! Mel, come in! Hello Mel, this is Luna Wolf, the witch who will be helping us with the festival. Oh my goodness, hello! You look around at Mel's office. You notice all the candles, insects, charms and magazines. She must be the ardent reader. You must be skilled in aging magic, you look so young! That's because she is... This is my friend's grandchild. I see, I see. Mel is my second in command. She's been a big help coordinating everything for the festival these past years. Yep, yep. And this year is going to be the best year... Exclamation points. I just remembered, I have a meeting to go to. If I run, I should still make it on time. Mel, it's right down the... Mel runs out the door before you can say anything. She has a loss of energy. As she does, I suppose we should go ahead and make our way around the village. Lead the way. <laughs> Cute. Uh, love it. Uh, so, we met them? Oh, there's still some villagers I'd like you to meet. Then I can show you your home. That's our home. Okay. <laughs> Why if I just take a quick peek? Let's go. <laughs> Very impatient. You walk to the town square. It's in a state of disarray. This is where we hold the Floralian Festival. I'm so sorry I'm saying things wrong. I am trying. <laughs> I will get there. <laughs> I know it looks a little chaotic, but it'll come together, I'm sure. Jonas can be pretty dependable. Can be? Jonas, are you around? Hey, Ruth. Whoa, is that a crow? Did you befriend it or something? Ramsay is my familiar. Familiar? Is that what they call pets these days? Luna Wolf is a witch. Oh. Jonas steps back a little. What's his deal? Our usual builder injured himself the other week, so Jonas is taking over in his place. Yep, tomorrow's my first full day in charge. How are things going? Good, I think. Everything should be in tip-top shape by the festival. Good, good. Well, we'll be on our way. N nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. Jonas walks away at a brisk pace. Oh, he was scared. <laughs> Bless. You approach a cafe. Ooh, let's see if Jean's around. Hello, Mayor. How can I help you? Oh, we're just stopping by. This is Luna Wolf, the witch helping us out for the festival. Mm. It's kind of awkward. <laughs> Have you met Mel yet? Yes. Jean and Mel are married. Cute! Really? <laughs> I mean, um, oh, that's nice. Opposites attract. <laughs> well, we'll be on our way. I just wanted to give a quick introduction. Goodbye. Jean walks off and tends to a customer. Jean can be quiet, but he's a wonderful baker. Make sure to stop by for a treat sometimes. Oh, I love treats. Me too. <laughs> No, no, because, you know, it's it's like me and my husband. My husband is very quiet um, and doesn't speak a lot, especially because he's quite shy, whereas I will talk a mile a minute. <laughs> it just happens sometimes. <laughs> this is my home. Let's see if anyone is here. Walk into the home and hear someone playing the guitar. That must be Devin. Devin, can you come here for a moment? Oh, um, sure, Ruth. Oh, they're so shy. Wow, this person looks uncomfortable. Maybe we came at a bad time. Devin, this is Luna Wolf, the witch I mentioned. Hello. Devin is friends with my granddaughter, uh, Nisha. They'll be writing the music for our festival. <laughs> That's great. I think it'll be wonderful. Well, we should let Devin get back to work. Nice meeting you. Devin shuffles their way back upstairs. Oh, they're shy. <laughs> so we can't go in those two. What's this one? That's right, we do have a store in Flora. Somehow I always forget about this store. How do you forget about a village single store? 
You should be able to buy some spell materials here. You approach the shop and try to open the door, but it doesn't budge. In fact, the store looks empty. You should try coming back tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow. Ah, okay. <laughs> it's not open. Oh, really? Okay. Right, who do we need to meet then? Because I can't go to these two. Um, in town square? No. Oh, over here. Ah, oh, I'm in the way of it. <laughs> Sorry. This is the art studio. My granddaughter, Nisha, should be around here somewhere. Oh, what the heck? Now I've got to clean up your mess again? Nisha, is everything okay? Cute! Oh, look at that outfit. Are they a painter? Cute. Oh, they are a painter. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah. I just accidentally knocked over some paints is all. Ah, oh, who are you? Nisha, that's not very polite. I'm Luna Wolf, your witch for the next two weeks. Weren't we expecting someone a lot older? Luna Wolf is my friend's grandchild and a witch in training. A witch in training? Don't we need a witch out of training? It'll be fine. Luna Wolf is a Von Teasel after all. Well, we should continue with our introductions. Sure. See you around. Bye. You turn and whisper to Ramsey. Get the thing she doesn't like us very much. You slow down and put some distance between you and Ruth. Psst, Ramsay. <laughs> Do you get the feeling people here don't like witchcraft? Ruth turns around. There you are. I thought I had lost you. I think it's time I show you your home. It's the one with the garden just this way. Now we can go here. Uh, home? Cool. You walk into a small cottage. Wow, it seems perfectly in order. Our previous witch used to live here. I'm not entirely sure who maintained it, but hopefully it's to your liking. Hmm. It's perfect. This cauldron shall serve us nicely. Yes, of course. Make sure to check your mailbox in the morning. That's how we send in our orders. The garden is just through that door. You'll find all the gardening equipment you need out there too. Then there's your wardrobe and bed. There's also this moon altar, the last witch set up. She used to decorate it with items she found around Flora. I think that's everything. We're glad you're here to help us. Mm. I'm afraid our village tour has tired me out. I should let you get settled anyway. Tomorrow is your first day on the job. Sure, um, thanks for the tour. Of course, goodbye for now. Yeah, all those introductions were a little awkward. Ugh, why did Gran do this to me? They don't want me here, and I don't want to be here. Getting to Saint would have been so much easier. There's got to be a way to get out of this. Think, Luna, think. Wait, I've got it. There's a calendar here, right? Let's take a look at it. This, what a pretty place. Yes, this is it. See, there's a full moon on the 8th. We just need to be as perfect as we possibly can until then. What was that? Then on the full moon, we'll perform a ritual that will solve all their problems or whatever right there and then. Ow! Cheating? How is that cheating? It's called efficiency. Do you really want to be stuck here for two weeks? I didn't think so. Do I really want to go back home though? I don't know. But we need to get out of here first. The rest we can figure out later. Yeah, I guess it's time to get some rest. I'm going to need it for tomorrow. Go to sleep. <laughs> Sleepy time. <laughs> it is morning already. Uh, can I sleep a little longer? <laughs> huh? I have work to do. No, I thought that was a bad dream. Well, maybe if you didn't remind me, I could have stayed in my ignorant bliss. I guess I should get these orders over and done with. The sooner we're out of here, the better. At least we only have one week of this, and then we can just use the power of the full moon to do the rest. Two week tasks done in a week, and then goodbye Flora and hello rest and relaxation. Yes, yes, I will go and check my mail now. 
Right, the game has saved, so I'm going to leave this part here. Um, I, I'm so excited to play more of this. <laughs> it's made me giggle a few times. It's so pretty. Everything is so pretty. I love this already. Um, yep, I can't wait to play more. I hope you've enjoyed this. Um, if you did, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And let me down below, are you playing this game? Or will you be playing this game? Um, let me know your thoughts. And I will see you in the next video. So, bye for now.